The United States of Amnesia seduces you to embrace forgetting. Is the Eurocentric plantation paradigm getting you down? Is the Eurocentric plantation paradigm and pandemic melancholic blues getting you down, down? Is the Eurocentric plantation paradigm and white terrorists who stormed the Capitol parading the Confederate flag in the rotunda on January 6th, 2021, getting you down, funky down, down? Ooh, I ask, because how long will white wokeness last? Ooh, I am brown, therefore I am suspect. I am Latino, therefore I am spicy. Y soy caliente también. I studied out in college, therefore I am un employed. I often speak in Spanish to confuse my gringo audiences, therefore I'm a pain in the conceptual derriere of monolingual gatekeepers and hegemonic cultural plantation epistemologies. Ooh, I often use big words, therefore I am superfluous. I Caramba, esto es para mi gente cruzando cada día, cada hora, cada segundo, cruzando una cicatriz colonial que no es natural. This is for my people crossing every day, every hour, every second to reclaim what was ours in the first place. Because the land never had any borders. Porque la tierra nunca tenía fronteras. Porque nuestros corazones no tienen fronteras. Because our hearts have no borders. Because this performance ritual. These verbal bullets are without borders. Porque este rito performativo y poema con verbalas no tiene fronteras. So let's dare to remember that that Rio Grande border is a colonial scar on the back of our sacred mother, Pacha, Mama, Mother Earth. It's an unnatural colonial cicatriz colonial. Let's stay to remember because the United States of Amnesia seduces you to embrace forgetting that the so-called beacon of democracy was founded on the near genocide extermination of indigenous native people. And here, the brutal Bienville French colonizer here in New Orleans uh, spilled the blood of indigenous people, slaughtered and enslaved, enslaved and slaughtered the Atacapa, the Cado, the Chitimacha, the Homa, the Natchez, the Tunica tribes. Let's stand to remember, he spilled their blood into the Mississippi River. There's nothing to celebrate about brutal Bienville, but the tourist brochures won't offer you that reality. Ooh, let's stand to remember that the so-called beacon of democracy, the United States of Amnesia, seduces you to embrace forgetting that these stolen lands from indigenous people were forged into a capitalist empire built on the enslavement of African people, men, women, and children, children in cages, children on auction blocks. And here, the Catholic slave port city, the Catholic slave port city of New Orleans was a premier outpost, was a premier port for the brutal slave trade, the selling of flesh, African people becoming chattel, transformed into perverse private property like the land. Let's stand to remember because the United States of Amnesia seduces you to embrace forgetting that the so-called beacon of democracy, that the northern territories of Mexico were stolen to expand and to create and forge manifest destiny. Stolen by Uncle Sam, the northern territories of Mexico from Texas to California, Oklahoma, Arizona, Nevada, New Mexico, Utah, stolen. And the rightful Mexican landowners became a subjugated underclass. Foreigners in their own land. English, the first language, and Spanish was broken on the backs of every Mexican child forbidden to speak it. And if those rightful Mexican landowners refused to give up their land, their territories, entire families were lynched. They became a segregated and subjugated underclass. Let's stay to remember, and let's take back the entire Southwest Territories. Yes, let's 
Let's make America Mexico again. Ooh, let's print up some blue mama hats. Ooh, take me back to mama with a taco truck on every corner. But there's no guacamole for immigrant haters. There's no guacamole for immigrant haters. There's no guacamole for immigrant haters. But Google the Guadalupe Hidalgo Treaty of 1848. Google the Guadalupe Hidalgo Treaty of 1848 and you will discover that truth of the Northern Territory stolen by Uncle Sam's hunger to manifest imperial destiny. Google it, baby, because Latinos, we love to Google. I love to say Google. Google, 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 Google. In fact, Google is a Latin term. Actually, Google is an old Aztec term from the Aztec goddess. Google gets it quietly, which means look it up as a know your history in the United States of amnesia that seduces you to embrace forgetting because it's the job of the poet. It's the job of the artist to speak the people's truth against the official lies. Caramba.